Hi, my name is Paul Moyner and today I'm going to talk to you about a management operating system. Uh, I've drawn it up here on the board uh, and basically the process is that we start here with forecasting, planning, do, reviewing and improving, so that follows the plan, do, check, act cycle and we can do that in a business uh, annually, quarterly, monthly, weekly, daily, shiftly and in real time. And it's important that what this does is it shows uh, the, 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 the process by which you connect the intentions and the plans of the management team with the work that happens in the front line to make the product or service that that business is responsible for doing for its customers. So, up here, I won't belabor this too much, but up, up here we're basically got the budgeting and medium term, long term planning process up here. And it all comes back to uh, an operational plan at about the monthly level. The most interesting part, I believe, is this bit where we transfer from uh, the, the week down to real time where the work actually happens, because that's where a lot of holes are in, in operations. So I'll just go through this quickly. So we've got resources, people, equipment, availability. So we need to have a roster, we need to have lead management, we need to know what equipment we've got, when it's going to be serviced, that kind of thing. Uh, at the weekly level here, we tend to have a weekly process and site plan that rolls down to daily plans and into detailed shift plans. And it's really great if those things are all connected to each other very strongly. Um, generally, on these kind of sites, you'll have a weekly planning meeting, which is designed to work out what the KPIs are that we're going to meet for the week and what targets we're going to hit. Uh, there's a daily commitment meeting, we're going to talk about targets again and get much more into the detail of the work that's going to happen on the shift. And really, in order to make this useful for the supervisor, we need to get into some really good detail about exactly what's going to happen, who's going to do it, where it's going to happen, etc. And that's all the responsibility of this detailed shift plan down the bottom. And it tends to be done by the superintendents and the frontline managers that are responsible for the work in that particular process down here. And there's often uh, a shift handover meeting which gets us a good dose of reality about what's going on down there at the front line so that we can, can, we can adapt the plan in a, in a start a shift commitment meeting so that that plan is in good, in good shape and in sufficient detail to be able to brief the crew in the pre-start meeting here. We brief the crew, the work's ready to go, uh, we're assigning, as the supervisor, we're out there, we're assigning work to people, we're following up to make sure it gets done, and we're keeping our plan for the shift in our hands and making sure we know where we're up to in it and what needs to be done next. So that's the job of the supervisor. Once we, once we get to the end of the shift, uh, it's a really valuable tool to be using here is this end of shift debrief. Meeting. So we get the end of the shift, we talk about the plan, how we went against it, what the actual results were against the plan, and we debrief and talk about the variances from the plan and what we're going to do to fix those so that they don't happen again. Likewise, there tends to be, uh, in a lot of sites, a daily review meeting where, where the superintendents and the, and the managers get together and talk about the plan versus actual, again, think about variances and discuss corrective actions. That should probably be done weekly as well, where we get a bit more into trends and root causes and we start thinking about improvement projects. And that will be done monthly as well and probably uh, at a much higher level on talking about improvement projects and changes in the budget and that sort of stuff. So what we've built here really is a really simple process from weekly plan through a really detailed shift plan, pre-start to brief the crew, hand it over to the guys, make sure it's getting done, think about it at the end of the shift, talk about it every day, and come back at the week. So this cycle goes round and round and round at a weekly level, it goes round and round at the shiftly level, where we talk about where we're up to in the shift handover, change the plan, put it back out to people, uh, it happens each day as well. And so you have these cycles of plan, do, check, act going, round and round and round, that continuously uh, put a good plan in the hand of supervisors, see how it's going, identify variances, talk about improving and correcting 
uh, issues, so you get rid of root causes of, um, of problems and you continuously improve the business. Get this thing going inside, this kind of a management operating system going inside most operations and you will continue, you'll get control, continuously improve performance and make the workplace more productive and safer. So often uh, the question is around this about uh, where does fusion fit into this uh, MOS picture. So fusion is, is basically designed to produce extremely good quality weekly, daily and shiftly plans so that they can be put into the hand of the supervisors and briefed so that guys can get on with them uh, and, and make sure the work is being done. Uh, we connect that to really good quality uh, touch screens so supervisors at the end of shift can punch their actuals into those touch screens and talk about performance and be held accountable for that. Uh, and we do simple daily reports where people can talk about at these daily review meetings where they can talk about uh, what went on, what went right, what went wrong at a management level and improve performance. And we do weekly reports as well. So we basically streamline this process of putting a weekly, gathering all the information necessary to put a great weekly plan together so that everybody on site is on the same page, convert that into detailed shiftly plans, put it into people's hands and manage this plan do act, check act cycle uh, every shift, every day and every week. That improves performance, improves results and reduces risk in the mind in operations.